banyak orang yang mau masuk asasi tau tapi kau yang dapat so macam opportunity tu is not open to everyone so you yang dapat ni opportunity buat yang terbaik since my batch had all our classes online i couldn't meet most of my group members physically time management tu orang boleh macam dua kali ganda kau lagi kena yang terbaik these are the things we had which i should have done because if i could have done that right i think i wouldn't have to burden other people so this is what i wish i knew before entering after the uni mind is that So what I wish I knew before entering Unimas Foundation is Hi everyone, my name is Mel. I am Dewi's roommate. No one really cares about where are you from or about your background, your academic background, your sport background, actually. One advice that I want to tell you before you enter as a senior is that always be good to everyone. But we don't know about the struggles. We don't know about what they have to face. Oh, the surrounding, you don't know about that. Don't judge your lecturer too early. Sometimes they're having difficulties too. If you don't understand, just ask the lecturer. They won't eat you. Me and my roommate, they will. Me and my roommate. Whenever we're having a long day, like a hurry and so you know? So we just buy all stuff KFC for our stuff we want. I, I, I always buy myself for boba. So I just have to buy boba during my Tough day, sorry. Hi, I am Azrul. You can call me Lul. Um, I am from Sabah. Okay, kami bukan biak Sabah. Saya ini original Sabah. And today I'm going to share my experience in Asasi Nimas. First of all, lah, kan, jangan tangguh kerja. So Asasi kan kita ada dua sem. So first first sem tu kita akan rasa macam free tau. Wish tak ada kerja um, orang bilang tak sibuk lah dia macam kerja pun datang sikit 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 begitu. Tapi tu lah aku bilang jangan tangguh kerja sebab kalau kau tangguh kerja yang kau rasa macam ala lama lagi dia dead buat ujung ujung nanti lah. So benda tu yang akan buat kau kau stress apabila berada di tengah tengah dan akhir sem tu sebab macam kau kena study lagi untuk uh, final um, lepas tu. Kau kena uh, buat assignment lah, kau kena urus program lah, kau kena buat report lah Banyak sebenarnya kerja So kau jangan tangguh kerja mu Kalau kau tangguh satu benda And then that benda yang lain tu akan orang bilang bergabung Dan membuatkan kau stres Kalau kau nak perform satu SEM SEM kedua tu kau kena perform gila-gila So kalau boleh perform dua-dua SEM Jadi orang bilang um, kau punya stres dan orang bilang Tense to study tu kurang lah Supaya kau dapat si GPA yang the best lah untuk kau pilih degree ni apa tarik kalau kau mau medik ha, macam tu lah math nanti dia akan ada bagi tutor akan ada bagi extra exercise memang banyak lah orang bilang tapi jangan tangguh dan jangan tinggal buat dan buat soalan final kah soalan mid sem kah dia akan orang bilang related dengan um, tutor dan extra exercise apa apatah lagi kalau math kalau boleh tutor tu jangan tiru Okay, maksudnya boleh tujuh Tapi like tanya kawanmu How they get this answer Sumpah lah kalau kamu nanti masuk um, college And then kamu akan spend time with your roommate, housemate Bonding dengan housemate dengan roommate tu Dia akan jadi lain macam tu Do your best for this foundation yes, yes. You can do it Okay, jangan mengalah di awal-awal perjuangan Okay, habiskan di mana yang kamu sudah mulakan Ah, gitu, okay What I wish I knew before entering Unimas is that the distance between the college and the ATN admission is quite far. So, um, I don't know about anyone else, but for me it's quite far and it requires a lot of time to walk uh, from the college to the ATN admission. So, I wish, um, I wish I knew it earlier and I could bring the bicycle or maybe some technology to transfer me to the college to attend machine more faster because mm, it's such a pain to walk with the hotness of the Malaysia I didn't quite remember about anything else but where I remember that I make a lot of great friends and one of them is um, um you know that person Adawiya It doesn't make sense that one brand can feel 72 different emotions all at once Hi, I'm Gibbs, so this is the main thing I wish I knew before I started university. 
I didn't realize that my emotions could be so fickle. Once you accept that studying is like a roller coaster, it's easier to deal with the twists, turns, and loop the loops. Remember that having a moment feeling like you're not doing well doesn't mean that you are. The negative prep will pass and you remember that you're doing okay. Last but not least, do enjoy your Asasi as much as you can. Make your life, make your study life in Asasi fun and memorable. Make friends so that you won't be alone and have someone or people to rely on. Wishing you the best for your Asasi later. Thank you and break leg. Hello everyone, my name is Yen and I took International Foundation in Life Sciences in Unimas. So what I wish I knew before entering Unimas Foundation is that there are actually a bunch of group projects and group assignments. But at the same time, I couldn't meet most of my group members physically. So it is actually very awkward for me to start the conversation during the first few times of my group discussion. So yeah, I would like to advise the juniors so that you guys will be more active in your group com group discussion or conversation and then don't be too shy you should learn how to initiate your group discussion and give your ideas and then divide your tasks equally and fairly and last but not least never 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 forget your submission time it is very very important so that you won't be deducted your marks will not be deducted yeah what i wish i knew before entering as a cinemas is Try to participate in all classes and discussion. You don't want to be annoyed. Also. So I'm going to show you um, one thing which I regret before not doing before entering as cinemas, uh, which is to involve myself in organizing team. Why? Because when I was when I was in when I entered as a cinemas, I was selected. I was voted to be the house leader. We have to organize an event. So back then, I didn't have that much knowledge. I have basic knowledge regarding organization teams like secretary, treasurer, stuff. But then I didn't have that deep knowledge regarding organization teams. So back then, I had some troubles, especially when it comes to let's say proposal letter. I'm pretty sure we all know who's gonna write the who's gonna write the proposal letter. It's the secretaries. But what's the content like? What are the format? What are you? How are you supposed to write it? Yeah, that's those are the part. Those are the ones which I did not know at the time. But then luckily I had my friend because they involved themselves more in organization team. So I was like, oh, do you know how to do this? Do you know how to do this? Yeah, uh, I was the general leader, so I was I, I had to manage this, I had to manage that, and from there. I get to see like this kind of stuff, this kind of skill, this kind of knowledge, experience is very important especially when it comes to yeah, when you're reaching this third tier level. So if you're able to involve yourself in more of events, let's say organizing events, I think it's pretty good and you should keep doing it. Involving yourself in uh, events because from there you gain a lot of things, I can tell you that. So I think that's all from me. Yeah, Rabi, actually I wanted to say, get an iPad for that video, but yeah, I have nothing to promote. Loki cool. And, ciao. Assalamualaikum and hi everyone, my name is Azmira Shazwani and I am from Shah Alam Selangor. So, what I wish I knew before entering Asasi Unimas is, you can totally depend on lecture notes provided by the lecturers. For chemistry and biology, um, the lecture notes are already perfect and sufficient. Um, you don't need to do any other notes uh, because the lecture notes are already more than enough. But for mathematics, I advise you to prepare a maths notebook. The space provided in maths lecture notes are quite small for me. I think it will look a little, a little bit messy if I try to write everything on the small space provided. And if you write in the notebook, Everything will be more organized and it will be much easier if you want to do any reference later. Like for example, if you have 4 new lecture videos on Monday, make sure to settle all of them by Monday too. Other than that, um, don't miss uh, doing tutorials and extra exercises. That actually helps a lot. And lastly, don't worry about the expenses in Asasi Unimas. If we can compare, I would say that Asasi Uni, uh, in Asasi Unimas, you can save more 
because um, the cost of um, your food is not very high. Um, I will give you like an example, nasi, it will cost you one ringgit, and then if you add uh, one chicken, it will cost you another two ringgit, and if you add um, sayo, uh, it will cost you another one ringgit. So I think that that is a good um, diet because you have uh, like uh, nasi, ayam, and sayo. So all of that only cost you four ringgit, which is actually very affordable. What I wish I knew before entering Dimas is have a timetable. Yeah, have a timetable. Then, if you have questions to ask the lecturers, please, please understand first. And if you can search on the internet or ask your friends what you want to ask or what you want to know before you going to proceed to ask your lecturer. So in case if you still have um, I mean in case if you still not clear with the understanding by watching the learning videos so please use appropriate language when you communicate with your lecturers. If you cannot use English you can also use Mahasa. Like me sometimes I use Mahasa to communicate with my lecturers. Although we are now learning via online, it is not wrong for us to speak our opinions, our ideas, just so that we can interact with other people. Hello guys, it's Pionk here. Uh, so I'm the alumni of International Foundation in Science offered by Unimas. So what I wish I knew before entering ASAC Unimas is that uh, lecturers are really good and they're really very supportive, considerate and very dedicated and committed in their teaching and they would really provide like external or additional like sort of like pollution or additional classes for those who are unable to catch up things through this online learning in the MS of pandemic so good luck guys break a leg bye bye Hello, this is Zoe and what I wish I knew before entering Asasi Unimas is that there is nobody who's going to go around and check your work no you're going to check all your work yourself especially during online class now which is important for you to give your best in your work and it is so easy to fall trap to doing careless work just because nobody is going to check it try to give your best in your work and in your assignments and if you do not know how to answer certain topic and stuff don't forget to ask for help bye so yeah do your best and congratulations to get in to Udimas okay foundation bye Bye. Um, just enjoy your assassin. Enjoy your moment in there. Like, um, if you get the chance to be in the campus, like capture every moment that you have. Just take every video that you can take because one day you will miss that. Thank you. Thank you to Devi because giving me this opportunity to share my experience so yeah let's go to the first question the event would be much smoother much, much smoother 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 yeah smoother yeah it would go smoother Don't